hustling on the streets of Benin City in Nigeria, dreaming of going to Europe. Desperate to escape poverty at home, the women here are easily lured by promises of jobs in Italy or France. The reality, whether in Palermo or Paris, is selling sex for as little as five to ten euros a time. Maybe I get there, I will marry, I have children, I live normal life, not to go there to Ozu again, because there the Ozu living is not very easy. It's between life and death. Last year, 37,500 Nigerians crossed the Med on their way to Europe. Most were from Benin City, many destined for sexual slavery in the hands of the human traffickers. Miracle spent eight years in Italy as a sex worker, but even now, the mother of two says it's her dream to return, to escape the misery of her country. We Nigerians, we are so wicked. Only the richest ones, they know. But the poor ones, they are dying for the poverty. With the Nigerian economy struggling, euros sent back to families at home can go a long way. I don't regard these people as victims of people deceiving them to get. They wanted to go and disregarding all risk, all moral implications, all values, they want to go because they know when they come and have something to shoot, building houses, driving flashy cars, nobody questions how did you make the money. Victims or not, the women are unworldly, poorly educated and searching for a way out of poverty. Whichever way they look, home or abroad, it's a stark choice.